assalamu alaikum friends my name is muhammad yunus and i am auto technical developer so in the previous videos we have discussed about the tree views how we can add the tree view like how we can specifically call it tree view from the action in this video we are just going to discuss about the form views like how we can add a form view so first of all you need to understand what is a form view so form you are basically used uh, if I explain here form you are used to create and edit a single record so let me just show you like uh, if we go here uh, to uh, sales and then uh, go to the products and if we click here on any of the uh, like if we click on the create button you can see this view so this is actually called the form view so form you are usually used to create a record so in this case you can create a new record and R you can it is used to edit the record so if you click on any of the record so you can just simply edit this record like this if you add something edit it and then save it so this is like two purpose of the form use okay and uh the the root element is three so like in case of form in case of a uh, tree view the root element is tree and in case of form view the root element is form so you just need to remember this so like you have graph view if you want to add the graph view, you need to add graph so they are composed of high level structure elements like groups notebooks and interactive elements like buttons and fields we will discuss about this in detail uh, but in this case we we just need to add some fields in the form view like in the form view we can also add some plain text html uh, which we will discuss in the upcoming videos but in this video we just need to discuss about the tree view so the, this this part is same for the tree view and the list view like if we go here you can see this is the basic a generic declaration of view but uh, if you want to add form view you just need to define the form you take and if you want to uh, uh, define the tree view you need to define the tree uh, tag so if you go here we just need to copy the generic code and then uh, reformat the code so here we need to add the view id which we can define by adding the module open uh, open academy and uh, here we need to add the model which is course and here we need to add the type which is form view so here we need to add uh, like the name of this view which is uh, like the model module name which is open academy body open academy uh, that course is the um, model name and uh, dot uh, type is form like this okay so here we need to add at the object which is object means the model which is open academy dot course open academy underscore open dot course which is uh, the model name which we have defined here in open academy dot py file here is the priority which is same is like we have discussed in the tree view and then here we need to add the root tag for the form which is form close it and here we can define the fields like uh, but for the fields we need to define it inside the groups uh, which you can see here like uh, groups which is of cold spin 4 and then uh, we want to add groups on the cold spin uh, 2 and cold uh, 2 so like you can add like this so by simply adding group and then inside the group you want to add another group like this and inside this group you want to add field name is equal to name so what is the field name and another group for the another field which is a description field name is equal to description and save it like this so uh let me just upgrade the module and then let's see what change we can have here okay search for the module and if the module upgrade successfully then we will uh, have to refresh the page so like if we go to the open academy I refresh this page and then if we click on this record you will be able to see the form view that we have added like this here you can see 
uh, this is the title this is the description like you can manually like you can uh, design it according to your requirements so we have just uh, skip one thing which we need to add here like a sheet okay we need to uh, close it inside the sheets we have to add all these uh, fields inside this sheet so let me just uh, like it is currently on the whole form so if we add the sheet it will as uh, squeeze and it will uh, like leave some space on the left and right side open academy upgrade the module okay so after the module upgrade you will see this change so let me refresh this page and here you can see there is some space on the left side and the right side which is looks fine okay so if you want to add these fields just before and after uh, like just bottom of this one so you just need to add inside one uh, group like let me just add it so if you add inside one group you will see it uh, on one side only okay upgrade the module again uh, OD Open Academy Academy. So let me just uh, save this search so that we don't uh, need to search it every time and upgrade the module. Okay, so let me refresh this page after the module upgrade and you will see it. So here you can see this is the title and this is the description. So in the next video, we will discuss how you can add a notebook inside this page to make it more attractive. Okay. So thank you guys for watching this video. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel and also click the bell icon so that you can get the updates of the upcoming videos. Thank you.